This is problem number eight from section 1.1. In this problem it says let f of x equal negative five x minus one and g of x equal x squared plus one. Find f of g of negative seven. So they're saying plug in negative seven into the g function and then take that output and plug that into the f function. Let's go ahead and set this up. So we have f of g of negative seven that's going to equal f, and then we're going to actually plug in negative 7 into the g function, f of negative 7 squared plus 1, All right, because we're replacing g of negative 7 with negative 7 being input into the g function, which is equal to f of, that's 49 plus 1, which is f of 50, which gives you, when you plug in f of 50, so into the f function, that's negative 5, 50 here for x minus 1, that's negative 250 minus 1, which is negative 251. So f of g of negative 7, when you plug it in, you end up with negative 251 because you plug the negative 7 into the g function. I end the g function. You get an output, which was 50, and you plug that into the f function, and you end up with negative 251.